In this quick demonstration, we're going to jump right into an email message where somebody actually wants to fill the same position they just filled at their company. So what I'm going to do, since I'm right in Microsoft Outlook and have a link here, I can click on that link and open that job order that's already been filled. So I can see that there is one person required and that position's already been filled and I'm just going to select that I want to copy this job order. Now it's going to start out Process Wizard that asks me um, if I want to post that on my website. And yes, I do, because that's something I want to fill right away. And do I want to initiate the high-priority job order to send out instant messages or other things to the recruiters? Yes, I want to do that as well. I'm going to click Next. And I'll finish, and that will have actually now created the new job order. I'm going to log in as a candidate and apply for that job order. So now as a job seeker, I'm going to log into the job site, search for jobs. And I see here there's an RN right at the top of the list that was posted today. I just click on that and apply for this position. And it's asking me the questions that are associated with that position. I can apply for that job. It tells me I've applied for it. Now if I switch back over to the dashboard as a recruiter back inside Microsoft Outlook and refresh that, I'll see that I've got a new website application from Anita that was just received. So now I hope you see it's how easy it is to post a job right from Microsoft Outlook and be able to see applicants right inside of Microsoft Outlook from your website.